In today's video, we'll be discussing chemotherapy, which is the standard treatment for mesothelioma. Chemotherapy, also known as systemic therapy, is administered by either injection, IV drop, port, or oral medication. The goal of chemotherapy is to kill all cancer cells that are in the body. Although it is not curative, chemotherapy is designed to accomplish several things. Kill mesothelioma cells, prevent cancerous cells from spreading, make other treatments more effective, such as surgery, shrink tumors, relieve pain, help increase the survival rate, and improve the patient's quality of life. There are four types of chemotherapy. Neoadjuvant therapy. This can improve the results by reducing the size of tumors, which in turn increases the chances of complete tumor removal after surgery. Radiation therapy. This is used in all patients with mesothelioma, but is especially beneficial to patients that have advanced stages of cancer. Adjuvant therapy, usually given after primary cancer treatment in order to prevent the cancer from returning. This is often done immediately after surgery as to target and kill all microcancerous cells left behind. Intraoperative chemotherapy. This chemotherapy is administered while the patient is in surgery. Doctors will apply high doses of chemotherapy directly to the tumors, and there are far less side effects this way. Possible side effects from chemotherapy include fatigue, which is the most common. Nausea and vomiting affects about 70 to 80% of patients. Mouth sores, diarrhea and constipation. Hair loss, emotional effects. 15 to 25% of patients being treated with chemotherapy report that they felt depressed both during and after the treatment. Memory problems. Patients have reported having a general state of fogginess. For more information regarding chemotherapy and treatment options, visit treatmesothelioma.org. Together, we are stronger.